Okay, so the next thing I wanna show you with regards to the harmonic structure of this little funky vamp that we're working on is how you can create different comping patterns that will express the harmony of the song. Without playing all the notes in each of these two seventh chords, instead what we're gonna do is just play the third and the seventh of every chord. And I like to do it in the lowest place possible on the instrument. So for my A minor seven chord, I'm gonna find the third and the seventh, and the lowest place that I can play that third and the seventh is a double stop. The third is a C, the seventh is a G. So I can just play this. Now for the D dominant seven, we have the third here and the seventh here. But instead of playing it way up high, so jumping from A minor seven here to D seven here, I'm gonna take the C note in the D chord, I'm gonna move it down the octave so that it's just here. So A minor seven is like this, D seven is like this. Now I'll play it against the, the vamp. And you can hear that when we use just those two notes, it's gonna give us all the harmony that we need. And then we can simply change up different rhythms. If you've enjoyed this YouTube video, I wanted to ask you to feel free to just subscribe to my YouTube channel. We're putting out tons of great videos all the time. Thanks a lot.